Welcome everyone, I'm Dustin Hams, and today I'm participating in the Highland Games. The Highland Games is a Scottish heavy athletics competition, and this video we'll be showing you the caber toss, the sheaf toss, and the weight over bar, also called the wall. So our objective for today, for those three events, would be to throw the caber directly in front of us, getting a 12 o'clock score, which is perfect. We're going to aim for a 12 feet weight over bar, which will be a personal best. And the sheaf toss, we did 24 feet three weeks ago, and today we're gonna to go for 26 feet. Dustin, what's this event? Uh, we're doing the sheaf toss. Uh, the sheaf toss is you use a pitchfork to throw a 16 pound bag over a bar. Um, last time we did this event, we got 24 feet, and so today we're going to go for 26. But today it's a little bit different. We have the wind going against us. So we'll see how well this works out. Watch yourself, you can't spin. Oh, nice! Yeah. Yeah. It's like spinning a ah. oh. hey. Spin to win. That's the rules. Spin to win. Oh, okay. Bump all the haters, spin oh. to win. Who's that? We're gonna change forks. So my fork, I can feel it giving on me. Um, it's dying. It's time for a new fork or fix it. So I'm gonna borrow AJ's fork and see how that performs. Uh, whenever you switch fork, you really don't know what's gonna happen. Um, he said his tines are pretty straight. So we'll see. We'll see if it comes off the fork. Come on, Justin. Hey, I'd like your stuff back. Oh, you missed! This guy's some short fingers there. Well, if it is, it's too late now. <laughs> Sometimes, when you know shit's going south, just have some fucking fun, man. This is all just for fucking fun anyways. Don't be so serious. Grab somebody else's fork, see how it works. Whatever. <laughs> what's the what's the takeaway? Uh, well, it depends on the bag too, and also like how you feel. Like I felt really good last time with the bag. I, I don't feel good today. Guess what? That's probably something to do with the food we ate. Let's go, Pat. So it is what it is, right? But come here, do your thing, have fun. It's not always about like win first place. I'll have some fun too. Dustin, yeah. what's this one? Yeah, we're doing the weight over bar. Um, it's a 56 pound weight with a chain directly connected to the weight, and we throw it for height. Uh, this is all bad. So, in that throw, I never extended my knees. Um, because I didn't extend my knees, I was just leaning backwards to get it to go up. 
So I was very lucky it even went over the bar. The next one, we're going to have to really jump up with our legs to get that weight to go up. I'm like, I'm the old man. You're adding like the worst neck. Here we go. Have fun duking it out. What's nice about this? Still perfect. Dustin. Hello, everyone. What's this one? We are doing the caber toss. <clears throat> the caber toss is like a telephone pole, it varies in lengths and weights depending on which division that we pick up and we throw over uh, or we throw it we toss it I guess you could say over and then we want it to land directly in front of us directly in front of us is a 12 which is a perfect score if we are unable to get it to turn over it's a degree rating normally 45 70 90 degrees are your scores All right, day's done. We just finished up Caber. That was the last event for the day. Recap for the day, we ran out of energy about halfway through, which we have to address for that. Um, so halfway through, we started doing sheaf and then weight over bar, and you really need a lot of power to go behind that because they're height events. So hopefully we can add one more protein shake to the day with banana and peanut butter and some more electrolytes and see how that makes us feel. Um, overall, we got two first place for the day, I think one second and a bunch of thirds. Um, not a bad event, got first in caber and first in heavyweight for distance. Those are big deals. So next event's in three weeks, we'll catch you then.